Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Designer Slash Gamer, and today we're playing like a world. So, uh, you guys remember Agent Chase? Agent Chase is part of an elite squad of special agents who protect Ivory City from villains and disasters and all kinds of terrible things. We're here on the moon at the special agent base with our friend Agent Chase and Agent Trace. Where'd she go? Hey, Agent Trace. What's up? Because we heard of a plot by Dr. Inferno to attack Ivory City. And we're actually not sure what he's planning. So we're here to formulate a plan and try to figure out... Uh, well, that's rude. We're here to try and figure out what Dr. Inferno is doing. Uh, Agent Trace, can you come back in here for two seconds? I know it's your, I know it's your day off, but we really need your help. You're gonna get paid. It's fine. I know your last check bounced. But, you know, we have money in the bank this time, so it'll be fine. Okay, so do we know what uh, Dr. Inferno's last known position is? <gasps> the Volcanic Laboratory? Uh-oh. What could he be doing there? Hmm. So do you know if our uh, surveillance system is still working there? Yeah? Well, I wonder if we can turn on those cameras and try to figure out what Dr. Inferno is up to. Okay, well, let's go up here. And let's head over here to the computer station and turn on those cameras. Okay, let's see. Here we go. <gasps> Agent Chase, that was an iMac Pro. Do you know how expensive those are? That's coming out of your check. <laughs> All right, we got a brand new iMac Pro here. Okay, this time, gently turn it on. What could all those henchmen be doing guarding the volcanic laboratory for uh, Dr. Inferno? Hey, Agent Trace? Man, where did she go? It's really hard to plan when she runs off like this. Where'd she go? Agent? Agent Tr Oh, there she is. Hey, Agent Trace, we have a great plan. So hear us out here. We're gonna head to the volcanic laboratory and we're gonna beat up one of the henchmen. We're gonna assume his identity and then we're gonna fool Dr. Inferno into believing that we're one of his henchmen. And then he'll reveal his entire diabolical infernal plan to us. How do you, what do you think about that? What? Do you think that's gonna work? What do you think? You think it'll work? Good, okay. Well, why don't we head to the rocket ship and we'll go to the volcanic laboratory and we'll see if we can figure out what Dr. Inferno is up to. You coming? Dude, the rocket's this way. Oh, never mind. Just be sure you take the next rocket out, okay? Because we gotta get over there pretty soon. Hey, space guy. <laughs> All right, Agent Chase, remember, Ivory City is depending on you to save them, and especially your girlfriend, Sheila, needs you right now. So, be on your best game, and let's figure out what uh, Dr. Inferno is up to. Okay, let's hop in the rocket ship, and let's head to Ivory City. All right, setting course for Ivory City, maximum warp. Look, there's the tunnel. So we started building that tunnel in the last episode, and it's, ooh, okay, where are we? Oh, we're skydiving, yay, okay. All right, ooh, there's a gold dragon. So you guys, our rocket is right down here, and if you guys saw the last episode, oh, hi, golden dragon, <laughs> and T-Rex, okay. Ooh, we should hide behind this car. That's not, that's, uh, that's scary. Who do you guys think's gonna win? The T-Rex or the gold dragon? All right. Look, we have to watch this fight. I mean, this is just too cool. Hmm. <laughs> I say the gold dragon will win. What do you think, Agent Chase? Oh, first casualty was the police guy over here. Hmm. This could take a while. I don't think we should be standing right here. <laughs> okay, where's the volcanic laboratory? <gasps> there it is. All right. I don't think we should go there during the day. I think we need some, uh, we need some cover. So I think nighttime is probably the best time 
to visit the volcanic laboratory. Hey, space guy. Oh no, you guys, jeez. No, Agent Chase, what are you doing? You are very reckless. Sheila would never do that. <laughs> Let's spin this guy so that it's nighttime and we have some good night cover. And let's head up there and see what Dr. Inferno is up to. Okay, there we go. Nighttime. Okay. Wow, this is going to take a long time, I think. I still vote on uh, the gold dragon winning it. Okay, let's see. Why don't we sneak up from over here? All right, let's see. There's a monkey. Is that one of his henchmen? Hmm. All right, you guys, we gotta be careful because there could be a henchman just lurking right around the corner. <gasps> you guys, it's a henchman! Oh no! We gotta get him! Get him, Agent Chase! Oh, thank goodness. Agent Chase, you're looking pretty convincing as this henchman here. <laughs> we have assumed the identity of one of Dr. Inferno's henchmen. And now we're going to go into the laboratory and try and find Dr. Inferno and see if he'll reveal his plan. Let's see. Okay. <gasps> Hello? Uh. Uh, has anyone seen Dr. Inferno? Uh, we're one of the henchmen and we just, we have a couple of questions for him about our henching duties. Oh, he's downstairs? Okay. What are you doing, spaceman? <laughs> okay, guys. Let's go into the underbelly of the volcanic laboratory and see if we can find Dr. Inferno. Oh, okay. Well, I guess that's the quickest way down. <gasps> there he is. Uh, hey, hey, Doc. Uh, could you tell us what your, uh, Inferno plan is? Uh, you know, we, we just, <laughs> we just need a refresher, you know, because... We just want to make sure that those stupid special agents don't, you know, figure it out. We want to be ready. Ugh, I'm tired of having to explain this to all of you. I need smarter henchmen. We're launching a missile from the moon to destroy Ivory City. I'm tired of being told what to do by that evil tyrant paleontologist Sheila. Uh-oh. Uh, so, Doctor, is there any way to stop this missile from launching? I mean... Just, you know, just so we know, so that the agents don't try anything. The only thing that could stop the rocket from launching is the ear-piercing scream and bad news of a Banshee woman. Okay, that's kind of weird. Um, okay, good to know. We'll go back to our henching duties, but just, just, how big is this missile and how much destruction could it do? We'll be safe underground, but Ivory City will be reduced to rubble. I mean, do we really need to do this, Doc? I mean, yes, good. Good for bad guys. Uh, good is bad. I don't know. Okay, Doc, we're gonna get back to our uh, henching duties here. We're gonna go back and hench a few things. Okay. Let's go over here and hide and change back into Agent Chase. Let's see, gotta get, make sure we're out of, uh, out of view here. Okay, that's better. We're not the henchman anymore. We gotta go find a banshee so we can stop that missile launch. We gotta protect Ivory City. Where's Agent Trace? Isn't she supposed to be here? All right, let's go up here and see if she's outside somewhere. And we don't want anybody to uh, clue in Dr. Inferno that we know what he's planning because then he'll just change it. Oh, I guess we shouldn't have changed back to our regular self yet. Uh, if any of you breathe a word of what's happening here, then I'll... Take away all of your sciency stuff. Yeah, that's right. No more beakers. Uh-huh. So, yeah. Don't say anything. You never saw us. You didn't hear anything. You didn't see anything. Okay. <laughs> Let's go find Agent Trace. Oh, there she is. Hey, Agent Trace. You will never believe what he has planned. He's got missiles pointed at Ivory City. Yeah. And the only way to stop the missiles from launching is to get a banshee and have the banshee scream at the missile launcher. Can you believe that? You can? I mean, I don't know why. That's really weird and unusual, but whatever. <laughs> All right, Agent Chase. We need to head to Monster Town to find a banshee. <gasps> is that Sheila? 
Oh, hey, Sheila. Hey, everything's fine. We got everything under control. Don't worry. Ivory City is in very good hands with Agent Chase and his special agent team. So, don't worry. There's no major plots to blow up the city or launch missiles. It's fine. We, it's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay, guys, we're going to head to Monster Town. But before we do, we have some friends to get moved into Ivory City. And we're not sure when we're going to be back over here because we have to head to the moon. So let's go ahead and get our brand new friends moved in. This is Peter. Peter's favorite color is blue. And Peter wanted to be the blue space guy. This is Dolce. Dolce wanted to be Lloyd. And Dolce's favorite color is yellow. This is Wolf Cat, and Wolf Cat's favorite color is black, and Wolf Cat wanted to be a black cat. This is Roman. Roman wanted to be Master Wu, and Roman's favorite color is green. This is Cameron. Cameron wanted to be Jay, and Cameron's favorite color is green. This is Aiden. Aiden's favorite color is black, and Aiden wanted to be the raptor, but we know that they aren't raptors, they're Coelophysis. Okay, so our friend Matthew wanted to be the male paleontologist, but I don't think there is a male paleontologist in LEGO World. So we're going to place Matthew as Major Quinn Steele because he looks like a paleontologist. And Matthew's favorite color is red. All right, let's head to the rocket ship. Before we do, we wanted to give a shout out to our friends in the UK. We have a lot of people who watch in the United States, but there's tons of people who also watch in the UK. So hi guys. <laughs> I haven't told you guys this yet, but actually I'm headed on a big trip in a couple of weeks and one of the stops is the United Kingdom, London actually, for several days. And I'm so excited because I've never seen London. I can't wait. <laughs> okay, let's head to the rocket ship and let's head to Monster Town and let's get a Banshee. Okay guys, we're here in Monster Town and it's terrifying and scary, but also really cool. I can't wait for Halloween. Okay, let's see, we gotta check the map. Where might a Banshee be? Hmm, let's go over here. Oh, uh, hey, stop in the name of the law. Have you seen a Banshee anywhere? Anyone? No? Hmm. Okay, let's walk around here and we'll keep looking at the map and see if we can find a Banshee. Oh, well, hello, my good sir. Have you seen a Banshee? You have? Where? Just north of here? Oh. Which way is north? I don't even know. Okay, why don't we check in one of these houses? Surely there's a banshee somewhere. Let's see. Let's close that door. Hello? <gasps> I think I see banshee dust. Um, oh! Why hello, my good banshee! Oh! I am an ancient spirit of ill omen and nobody likes my news! So I wander the streets and wail and weep. And I have very bad news for you, Agent Chase. What? You do? Uh-oh. I hope it's not about a missile and cities being destroyed, is it? Is it? Oh, it's terrible. It's so terrible I can barely speak the words. One day, when you least expect it, you'll drop your ice cream. Right up the cone and into the street. Oh, it's terrible. Truly terrible. Yeah, that's, uh, that's terrible. That's just terrible news. Uh, hey, Banshee Lady, do you mind coming with us to the moon? I know most people don't like hearing your bad news about their future, but I know someone who loves bad news. And I think he would love talking to you. Okay, come with us to the rocket ship. Oh, hey, Agent Trace. How's it going? Hey, so we convinced the Banshee to come with us. Yeah, it wasn't easy, you know. Well, can you stop for a second? Where's she going? Hey, yeah, it wasn't easy, but we finally convinced the Banshee to come with us to the moon. Yeah, I know, it's hilarious. Because apparently we're doing all the work. <laughs> all right, ladies, let's head back to the rocket ship and let's go to the moon and let's stop this, uh, this terrible, rocket from destroying ivory city oh you guys the moon is so cool here i love monster town all right let's hop in the rocket ship here and let's head to the moon hey banshee oh okay well i'm sure they're i'm sure they're on their way all right let's hop in here <laughs> we're going to the moon with the banshee and with agent trace Okay guys, here we are on the moon. We got the Banshee, we got Agent Trace over here somewhere. Hey guys, 
Let's go find the launch site. Nice move, Agent Chase. Okay, let's see. Where's that launch site? I think it's over here somewhere. Banshee! This way! <laughs> you guys, my dog is dreaming. That's that sound you hear. <laughs> Theodore! Wake up, buddy! Wake up, you silly guy! Daddy's trying to record. <laughs> oh, okay, this must be the rockets. Alright, where's that Banshee? <gasps> Dr. Inferno! What are you doing here? Did you really think you had fooled me? I saw right through your silly disguise. Then why did you reveal your evil plan to us if you knew we weren't one of your henchmen? Well, I... Hmm. Yeah. That's what I thought. I see you've brought an old, obnoxious woman. Hey, hey, hey. You be nice to Agent Trace. This is her day off. She doesn't even have to work today, but she wants to work to fight bad guys like you. Oh. You meant the Banshee. Yeah, we brought the Banshee, and she's gonna stop you from launching this missile. Nice try. But like your height, you come up a bit short. Dynamite! Attack! <laughs> 